here we are performing a functionality test on a DME temperature controller that is used in a plastics injection molding application. So here we have our connection set up, which is we have our 220 AC coming in here. We have our lamp set up on the output of these two plugs here. And then we have our positive and negative inputs to our simulator, which is the Fluke 743B documenting process calibrator, which will provide a simulation of a J-type thermocouple that would normally be plugged into this device to give us a temperature reading in the system. So here we show that our lamps or our output is not on because right now we are near or at the set point which we have programmed into the device which is 490 degrees. Now the fluke meter will allow us to increase or decrease this in order to observe changes. So we are going to go ahead and lower the temperature to 450 degrees Fahrenheit and as you can see now the output is on, just like in an injection molding application. This would allow this controller to increase the heat if the temperature drops dramatically. And as you can see, as we increase the temperature here, the light bulbs turn off. Now we will decrease again, and the output is on. And then, as you can see, it is reading the correct temperature information on the front display. So we will go ahead and increase the temperature again. Now we are back off. And we will actually show you the change. So down low, and as you can see, it's feeding more output in an attempt to increase that temperature. Okay, we are going to go ahead and increase the temperature again. And we are back off. So in this way, we can make sure that the temperature controller can regulate the output as well as maintain an accurate temperature reading using a thermal couple. Thank you for watching. For more videos, subscribe to our channel.